I know that for the most part, everybody's been really happy with Google Photos, but the one feature that most of my teachers are really missing from Picasa is the slideshow. I mean, Google Photos is great as far as the layout and being able to organize your photos and those kind of things, but it's that slideshow and being able to embed photos of their students that's really the one feature that is really lacking. Well, I have a solution for you with this, and it's actually very simple. Once you're signed in to your Google account, you go to youtube.com and click on the upload button. Now you'll notice that most of the time we're, we're just uploading some type of video, but notice here you can create a slideshow. So if I click create, what happens is it takes me to my Google Photos and I can go in and I can select individual photos or I can select an album. I'm going to select this album from our visit to Cambodia. And uh, I, am, I click on select and what happens is Google gives me the option to rearrange the photos, which I am not going to do. I'm just going to leave them in the, in the order that they were in my um, album. And then I'm going to just go ahead and click on next. And here I have the option to change the duration of the fo photos, so I can make it uh, as, as short to as short as um, one second. But there's also this great feature, and as long as ten seconds. There's also this great feature where I can fit it to the music. And so what that will do is, whichever song I pick, it's going to make my photos fit into that. So I'm going to go with that one. And then the slide effect. Notice here it's pan and zoom. And I also have the choice of none, which would just be switching the photos back and forth. And my transition options are these. So I'm going to leave it as crossfade. I, that's just the one I like. I'm going to go ahead and then take a look at which song I would like to use. And uh, notice you have a bunch of different options. These are top tracks, but you can also search for a bunch of others. Now let's take a listen to Across the Ocean by J.R. Tundra and see how that sounds. Perfect. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and upload and then this will process just like any other YouTube video. I have all these different options. I can share it on Google Plus and Twitter and all those other kind of things. And best of all, I can embed it very easily into any website. So now I can post photos of my students very easily and embed them in my website. Now, just a few short minutes later, my movie is done and ready to share with the world. And uh, I can do that with just a link or I can go and click on the embed option and I can embed this in my website. Also, I realized I didn't name it, so I should have, and I can always go back and I can return to editing and rename my movie, and I'm gonna call it Tapram because that's the name of the ruins we were looking at. And also, I might not want this to be a listed movie, especially if it's photos of my students, and, but I will have it unlisted so that I can embed it in my site. So I'm gonna go ahead and select that save the changes and now here we are on my YouTube channel and as you can see my to prom video now is here and I can easily just click on it and go ahead and watch it and I have a three-minute slideshow that is my photos